Hi, so I recorded the voiceover for this video at about half ten at night and I'm honestly just rambling through the whole thing and I say a lot of ums a lot so I just want to apologise for that but I hope you still enjoy the video, I hope you get something out of it uh, just take some tips or whatever, I don't care um, just have a good day dude, stay safe Right, hello lads, you've all been asking for a makeup tutorial so here you go you finally won me over, you're having a makeup tutorial Right, this is me messing around with my face, trying to find my primer. Okay, I've got this Olivia Hale primer. I think it was about 99p from Home Bargains. Um, yeah, just smother that all over my face. Uh, this is just a basic cosplay makeup tutorial, I guess. It doesn't have to, you don't have to follow it. I don't, I don't care. Just take some tips from it if you want. Uh, this is a color corrector. Uh, W7 color corrector. I think it was about 3 dollars from just this random corner shop. I also get my foundation from there. Um, it's just a random corner shop in my town, like, I, I don't know what else to say, lads. <laughs> also, it's like half nine at night, uh, half ten at night, actually, uh, while I'm recording this, so, yeah, you guys me putting a bit more on, because apparently there wasn't enough, even though my chin looks fucking green as shit. I forgot to say this swearing in this. Um, this is, uh, my concealer is from Primark. I th I'm pretty sure the foundation stick, which is a big one, was 199 and the concealer stick was 99p. Um, I used just both. Um, my shade is porcelain, I think. So yeah, um, uh, we're gonna blend that in. Oh wow, I keep saying um. Also, I do that a lot. I do that piece thing. I do that a lot throughout the whole video. Just ignore it. It, it just happens to be there. Okay, so next I'm taking my W7 HD foundation. I think this is about a fiver from that random corner shop that I was on about earlier. Um, I Apparently my old one didn't work, so I got my new one, which I bought before quarantine, lucky enough. Um, turns out this wasn't actually the shade that I was going for. It was slightly darker, uh, which gave me a weird colour at the end, but like, whatever. And I usually get the shade lighter than this one, but apparently I, I just didn't pick that one up. So now I've got to deal with this for about four weeks. Jeez. <laughs> Here's me vibing again. We get it, Sarah, and you're a fucking TikToker. We get it, okay? Anyway, <laughs> this is my makeup gallery pressed powder. This was one pound from Poundland. Woo, <sighs> there was a hair on my screen. Um, yeah, th there you go. I'm putting that on my face, you know, I put a lot. Oh, this is my baby powder. I found myself very entertaining. I'm a greasy ass bitch. So um, I use baby powder all over my face. You can probably get this from Asda. I don't know how much it is, but. Yeah, I just put that literally in my T-zone and stuff. Wherever I'm greasy, I just put that. Uh, you don't have to do this. It's just something I do. It works for me. It might not work for you. But yeah, it's just something I do after powder. I don't know why people always judge me about it on live streams. But oh well. Oh, there you go. Get dusty. Amazing. Yeah, I'm just patting my face over because I'm a vain bitch. I did the peace thing again. Oh, this is my Pro Sculpt palette. I got this for Christmas. So I'm not sure how much it was or where the heck it was from, but um, you can just use any cool tone. I would say I would say cool tone um, contour because it looks better with skin, looks more natural. But like dark cool tones is good for contour. But whatever floats your boat, you know. That's just what I would say. And bear in mind, I haven't even been cosplaying for a year yet, so I I'm still not the best. But people wanted a makeup tutorial, so a makeup tutorial you shall receive. This is this is me trying to do my nose. Let's not talk about the nose, okay? Let's just not talk about it. Yeah, okay, okay. You done yet? Oh, now I'm gonna do my eyes. This makes my eyes look more hollow. I don't know why I do this. I just like how it looks. Um, I don't do it with every cosplay, but um, for this one, which is Vampire Bakugo, I am gonna do it because it makes me look more tired and it just makes me look a bit more male, I guess, because they have more sunken set eyes or deeper set eyes, I guess. So I just decided to do that. I'm putting a bit underneath because it didn't get underneath very well. Because of the shape of my eye. Oh, now I've got this uh, MUA Professional Palette. Um, I don't know the price of it. I'm pretty sure it was about £7. Uh, it's from Superdrug. It's pretty damn cool. Uh, I just take the red from that. Like, straight up red eyeshadow. It doesn't have to be from this palette. It's literally red eyeshadow. Um, and I put that, like, at the tops of my cheeks, as you can see. Like, where I've gone a bit into my temples and stuff. On my nose, so I look like a fucking clown. Um, and on my other cheek, obviously. Can't miss that cheek. But I don't really like um, putting it on the apples of my cheeks because I feel like that's a bit more feminine if I do that. So I just keep it on the upper part of my cheeks. Now I'm taking uh, this blush from, I don't know, my Rimmel Highlighter and Contour Blush Palette. 
I think it's called, I don't know. But um, yeah, and now I'm taking highlight from that to do highlight. Wow, Saren, you're so fast. I got this years ago though, I have no clue where it's from or the price. Uh, you'll probably find it around somewhere, I don't know. Wow, yeah, I love highlighter. Oh, this is the MUA Shimmer Highlight Powder. This was good when I first got it, but it's slowly decreased in quality as time's gone by. But it was only £3 from Superdrug, so like, psh, I'm not complaining really. <laughs> also, I'm doing this in one big long take, so if you hear me saying um a lot, shush, shush, shush. Oh, this is my rainbow highlighter. Um, I lost the cap for this, so I don't know where the, where the frig the cap went, but I can't tell you what it is. Oh, I also take this little brush here just to get the details like underneath the brows in the corner of the eye, the cupid's bow and stuff. I use that little brush for it. I should probably use it for eyeshadow because it's a very good brush, but oh well. I have decided to use it for um, highlighter. Now I'm doing eyeshadow. This is the EYN Bright Matte Palette. Uh, Carmen got me this for my birthday. Thank you so much, dude. Literally love it. It's my favorite palette. Um, I'm taking the shade Preppy Pecan. Pecan? Yeah, sure. Um, putting that in the corner of my eye-ish. The cre- what is that called? I don't know. I don't know scientific anatomy terms. Anatomical? I don't fucking know, bro. Okay, now I'm taking my other brush to get the shade Head Over Heels, which is this like dark brown color. Brown? Whoa! That's red, Saren. This dark red color, which looks- it's like one of my favorite colors in the palette. I love it. I just love dark reds and stuff. And I'm blending that with the uh, brown shade that I had and just bringing it up and under the eye. I like a lot of red underneath my eyes because, I don't know, it looks cool. I have hooded eyelids so uh, stuff underneath my eyes tends to show up better than on top of my eye. What is this? Oh, wait, we're now blending even more. I don't think I- no, I put more on my brush, yeah. Um, and I just like to go over the brown again to blend it all back out. I never like doing the outer bit first for some reason. Oh, now I'm doing my eyebrows and just taking that palette from before. Um, that concentration though. <laughs> um, my eyebrows always look shit. I've, I've just come to terms with it now. Um, they always look really crap. I'll learn how to do them someday. But I literally just outline my natural shape and then I fill it in with black. Because I yeah, they're always black, I guess. Unless I'm doing something with red hair or blue hair or something. I don't know. I don't know, bro. But for Bakugo, I usually do black. And this is me trying to get them perfect but they never do look perfect but it's fine um and now i'm going through them with a the spoolie because uh combing my eyebrows is fun i guess yeah wow you look shit um yeah the, this is the rimmel scandal eyes this is my favorite liquid eyeliner it was about three pounds i think i got this one from morrison's but honestly you can get it anywhere it's rimmel london like it's everywhere you know uh, first I line just the top of my eye and then I go down into the inner corner and I like bring it down into a line there as you can see and then it kind of like frames my eye a bit. I have hooded eyes again. I, I have hooded eyes so I have to do this. This is my technique and then I bring the ends out a little bit and then I bring that into like a kind of like a triangle to go up into my eye. Kind of makes it look like an anime eye but I usually just do it just to elongate my eye a bit more. Here's me struggling with the second eye. I think I got the second eye fine. Um, oh, this is my favorite eyeliner of all time. I have gone through a lot of eyeliner in my life. This is my favorite. Um, it's the Rimmel Exaggerate Pencil Liner. It was about $2.99 from Superdrug, I think. Um, here's me being sneezy. Oh, I don't know where the heck I got this from. Honestly, I've had this for ages. It's just a large black eyeliner with a smudger on the end. And I just smudge it all in. Here's me going over a line because it's smudged, believe it or not. Oh, this is- I got this for Christmas. It's just lip butter. It's just, it's just any lip balm will do. I, I just need to take off the foundation that's on my lips. So I get like a little cotton pad and then drag that off. Oh, oh, I w put way too much on my hand. I remember that moment. That was crazy. <laughs> and now I'm taking this uh, Makeup Gallery Brown Eyeliner Pencil. This was £1 from Poundland. I get most of my shit from Poundland, honestly. Most of my shit is very cheap. Uh, here's me doing the edges with that black eyeliner again because I felt like it and then I'm drawing lines I love lines <laughs> they're cool uh, cross on my other eye because I'm edgy as heck and a dot why not and here's me realizing Psh, I need to do some more lines dude more lines you know of course oh there's my hair even though that's gonna be in a wig cap in a second oh well 
these are my favorite pairs of suspenders actually but um i got them for christmas i have no clue where i got them from and i did them up the wrong way come on realize it there you go there you go you got it uh but yeah th these are pretty cool don't know where i got them from but they're cool uh that i got that from blue banana i think it was about 3.99 it's one of my favorite necklaces it's just very nice uh, i got these from wish they were about two pound with shipping included uh this is a fake septum ring one pound from wish shipping included these are my fangs everybody was asking me where i get them from uh they're about one pound from wish shipping included and the glue i'm using is polygrip denture glue you can literally get that anywhere if anywhere sells medication or anything like asda you're gonna find it there it's literally just for dentures oh this is a wig cap why am i describing wig caps to y'all anyway wig cap it comes with wigs you put it on before a wig it covers your hair here's me styling my bakugo wig because apparently i'm co a, an illiterate cosplayer but not illiterate because that would make no sense because i'm not wording i'm just gonna shush because i have no clue what i'm saying anymore and it's still very late at night damn damn that was great it looks awful um but yeah here's me feeling myself and then i'm putting more black eyeliner on my lips because i wasn't satisfied um then i'm doing the corners in liquid eyeliner to bring it in and then i'm going over with more black because i still was not satisfied uh, and then i'm going over with concealer because again i was not satisfied um i just wanted to yeah i don't know i don't know what i was doing to be honest and there you go there's the finished look here's me vibing um i hope you enjoyed this makeup tutorial yeah bye <laughs>